Tonight, I am caterpillar soup, melted down to the bones, all my panic calmed. How will I ever give you up, thrive without this sunlight? Staggering outside, I feel unnerved that the sun is blazing. Gasping out alien sounds as birds sing, oblivious I pluck a dandelion, blasting its soft seeds onto an uncertain breeze, and it's all so fragile, I can't stand it. Her spine shivers, he is here again, with his deadly smile and his soft drawl. Always dancing with death on a back alley tightrope, howling his name into the dark like a dare. Next time she calls you, pick up the phone and tell her you love her too. No one else can do this for you and if you don't, she will die or she will kill you or the world will take her from you and turn her against you. Trust me, take back her power so she's not erased from the alphabet. Spread your two fingers and raise them proudly. V is for vagina and she will be heard. I've learned in the most sublime and vicious way that if you starve desire, it doesn't die, it just eats you instead. So what you force to be small screams to thrive, makes you run from the one thing that makes you feel alive because God forbid anyone should hear your true animal howling. And this is all I can think about in the middle of the orgy. Now I know when I'm missing, it's all electrical thunderstorms and exquisite rainbows. Desire is all weather and no mercy. I am scared, lover, that your freedom has ruined me. We are a many-limbed, ubiquitous goddess, laughing at petty wars, armed with spiders' webs and witches' spells. We have eaten the hearts of our would-be destroyers and live despite the poison. We have no intention of behaving ourselves.